right there. I'm back home. Now, let's talk about this topic. Uh, some minutes ago, I filmed one uh, message to my one it is. And it was about the problem that many people face. Uh, and the problem, I can summarize it like this. That sometimes the person you like the most, in this case your one it is, she's just ghosting you. You know what is the meaning. Uh, just stop uh, sending messages. In my case, it's maybe too early to say so, because uh, it was only one day uh, that I see she's online and she's watching something, she's having some online activity, but doesn't, uh, maybe doesn't care about what I sent her, or let's say uh, maybe there are some hackers who delete my messages, or um, some bad friends said something, or the parents uh, said don't chat with him anymore, okay, whatever. Uh, there are sometimes subjective reasons, like, oh, I don't want to send him anything, or sometimes there are objective reasons, like, I, as I said, it can be anything, a relative, uh, some uh, uh, friend, the boyfriend, <laughs> if there is any. Uh, well, and uh, the point is that, I mean, in these situations, uh, many of you, I mean, uh, girls, who like very much somebody, or boys who like very much somebody, will overreact and will start to speak, I saw you online and you... Why you don't care about me? <laughs> and so on. Overreactions, uh, quarrels, uh, things that are uh, totally not necessary. And I mean, I will give you an example how you can just react normally and you can be polite and you can send just a message in uh, my style where I just explain how I feel, that I feel a bit upset and I worry, I really worry about what's going on with her, especially in this uh, a little difficult situation about her, I'm not uh, going into details and so on. And I mean, just take it as a good example how you can behave uh, politely, uh, with uh, all these feelings, I mean, you can express all these feelings, but without being rude, without being uh, oversensitive, and so on and so on. So, take a look, it's not a secret, because uh, I didn't mention her name, her location, and so on and so on, you can uh, hear and watch it uh, with your full attention. Just take a good example how to behave normally and friendly to uh, the people you like very much, uh, because uh, anyway it is your one it is, right? You don't want to make him or her uh, upset and um, to block you and then what? You will never maybe be in touch with him or with her again. So take it as a good example. Okay, enough talking. Have a good watch. Thanks. Hi. Minutes earlier. I'm not going to say your name, but you know who you are. And you know that this message is especially for you. Well, I want to tell you this, that to be honest, every single minute you're on my mind and I'm thinking about you, I'm missing you. And especially now when there are some problems, like, you know, financial, money, food, and I'm not going to go into details. Especially now, I would like to know, are you okay? Do you need something? Let me know. Yes. I really miss the chats. Our chats, our conversations, and I feel sad without you online. So please 
when you're online at least send me one word that I'm okay one sentence and if it's possible let's chat a bit more how is everything going with the new place please change some funny things I don't know everything everything was for me makes me feel very very happy and I just hope that we can be in touch again soon every hour every single hour I'm checking my messages and when there is nothing no texting and I feel upset I feel I worry too much but I'm not going to send you again and again and again and again I hate this way because I don't want to disturb people at all but I hope that I can receive at least one good sentence from you soon well best wishes bye